Hi, we all have budgets, we all live with some budgets, so here my video comes, top 10 budget smartphones of 2016, I have already done a video on top 5 smartphones of 2016, you can check the video on my channel, so guys welcome to my new video, top 10 smartphones of 2016, budget in budget level so i categorize this smartphone into four categories one category is below 10000 rupees next is below 15000 rupees and next 25000 rupees and the foremost 30000 rupees that's i consider a budget the maximum i can go for is 30000 rupees so I select a winner, a runner-up, and an honorable mention in each, in each category. So I will explain about the smartphones. I will leave the link in the description below for the smartphones. And you can, if you are interested in buying this smartphone, you can use that link to buy the smartphone, which will definitely help the channel. So here comes the first category, the most budget category that is 10,000 rupees. I think we had a lot of competition this year in this category. Smartphones are getting cheaper, cheaper smartphones are getting more, I think more quality. We can, with a constrained budget we can get a phone with all features. So such one phone is Xiaomi Redmi 3S. This is the best budget phone of 2016 i think so because if you have only a small budget of 7000 rupees you can buy this phone this is flipkart exclusive and which is hard to get a hand on this phone because it's huge demand so this phone comes with a snapdragon chipset very fast also the battery life is insane on this uh, smartphone also if you can spend uh, 2000 rupees more then you can get a, a redmi 3s prime which has fingerprint scanner and 30 gigabytes of storage so here in my runner-up position here comes the Lenovo K6 power the newly launched Lenovo K6 power which is also Flipkart exclusive is priced at 999 rupees it is powered by a Snapdragon 430 processor it has 3 gigabytes of RAM 30 gigabytes of storage full HD display it's also one of the best smartphone you can buy right now under the budget of 10,000 rupees and I choose a smartphone in this category, as honorable mention is Asus Zenfone Max 2016, which is powered by Snapdragon 615 processor. It has a 5000 mAh battery, I said it 5000 mAh battery. It takes a lot of time to charge, but if you are a power user, if you want your phone to last for 2 days or 3 days, this is the phone for you, Asus Zenfone Max. It's a great option. It has a good camera. So that is a that is a, my pick for under 10,000 category. When it comes to the 15,000 category, the most selling phone in India in 2016 was Xiaomi Redmi Note 3. Everyone had heard about Xiaomi Redmi Note 3. Xiaomi had a best and a great year with budget smartphone in 2016, and Redmi Note 3 was no exception. It was best at cheap. You have to pay 12,000 rupees to get a Snapdragon 650 processor, 3 GB of RAM, 30 GB of storage. Also, it comes with uh, good, good quality camera. Even though camera is a little bit mediocre in low light situations, if you can cope with then this is the best phone you can buy in 2016 under 15,000 budget. And the runner up I suggest the, in this category is Moto G4 Plus. Moto G4 Plus is the best budget phone with camera best camera smartphone in budget under 15,000 rupees if you are a type of heavy user I don't recommend this phone because it has some serious heating issues when you, if you are into gaming or some heavy multitasking it, it may exhibit some heat so I suggest if you are a heavy user please stay away from Moto G4 plus also I select 
uh, in this category the uh, runner up uh, has Moto M Moto M is a very newly launched device which is also Flipkart exclusive device this price at 16000 rupees it's an all metal body the first all metal uh, designing from but budget designing from Motorola it available only in gold color and it has a rear mounted fingerprint scanner a good uh, camera also it is powered by snap um, sorry MediaTek P P15 processor it is snappy and good also yeah it gets the job done it's one of the best phones under you it is even slightly priced above 15,000 rupees so it's uh, given as a honorable mention in this category next category is 25,000 rupees and I think this is one of the best phones in this ender segment because Moto Z, Moto Z Play delivers excellent value for money it, 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 is, uh, it is powered by Snapdragon 625 processor and also its build quality is amazing the, the, I don't think that there is no phone in this category which has superb build quality like Moto Z Play it is a bunny energizer I would say that it will never die because it has the 3400mAh uh, 3, battery and the chipset makes great optimization uh, Snapdragon 65 makes it it is a hard to die device because the battery life is insane and nothing short of absolute, absolutely fantastic in Moto Z Play and if you I think the runner up in the device in this category I select Xiaomi Mi5 Mi5 yeah it was a very good phone it has OIS in its camera and the, it is very stylish phone if you look into Mi5 I think it's a very stylish phone with metal and glass yeah, I have still complained about Xiaomi not launching 64 GB version in India but still if you can live with 32 GB version Mi4 is available around 23,000 rupees in this first world sale it was available for 900 uh, uh, sorry 20,000 rupees around 19,999 rupees so for 20,000 rupees Mi5 is a great phone because it is a great camera also a 3000 mAh battery also to, to, uh, totally its value for I think the 24,000 uh, 20, uh, 20, rupees Mi5 is great device it's great value for money because Xiaomi is uh, its flagship Xiaomi flagship device it, ha it has a Snapdragon 820 processor also Xiaomi Mi UI 8 which is uh, based on Android Marshmallow so that will be a great choice if you are looking for a phone under 25,000 rupees so the next category is around 30,000 rupees in 30,000 rupees there is only one phone I think which wins all this category that is the OnePlus 3T the OnePlus 3T or OnePlus 3 OnePlus 3T powered by Snapdragon 821 chipset it has 6 GB of RAM, 16 megapixel both front and rear facing cameras and AMOLED LED panel and it has a fingerprint scanner mounted on the home button so OnePlus 3, there is a slight difference there is only a slight difference between OnePlus 3 and OnePlus 3T if you already have a OnePlus 3 I don't suggest you go for OnePlus 3T but if you are looking for buying a device around 30,000 rupees you can definitely go for OnePlus 3T that's the best and uh, great device you can buy also I, I am mentioning that the phone is uh, the dash charging technology the proprietary uh, feature of oneplus it is the fastest charging phone in the world I said it it is the fastest charging because no other brands or phone can beat how fastly oneplus 3 get charged get recharged to 100 percentage just below one hour or 50 minutes is just enough to charge a 3000 ms battery I think that's great from OnePlus OnePlus had a great year 2016 and we are expecting more from them and I think the runner up in this category of about uh, 30,000 rupees is Honor 8 Huawei Honor 8 yeah the phone build quality is very good it is uh, built with metal and glass like the Xiaomi Mi5 or maybe the Galaxy's Samsung Galaxy S7 like that and it has the, the only form with dual camera it has a monochrome sensor also in primary in, in the primary camera so 
if you are into the camera department if you want uh, the monochrome sensor and if you love dual cameras this is the only phone you can get in this budget with dual cameras also I'm not a big fan of uh, Huawei's emotion UI also but it gets the job done I think Honor 8 is a great device it has a great camera great capabilities if you are into the budget definitely you can look for Huawei Honor 8 so guys that's all that's all for this video and if you want to buy any of this device there is link down in the description you can click and it will help that uh, you can click and buy that link it will help the channel thank you for watching uh, that's all thanks